Hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Matt, and I'm going to tell you a little story about these fins and kind of a, a little lesson they taught me about life. Uh, so pretty much a few summers ago, I bought a, a pair of pretty expensive fins online called Tech 2s. They're like great for bodyboarding, and uh, yeah, they're really expensive, about 120 bucks. And I bought them, and uh, they came about a week later, and the next day, uh, me and my buddy decided to go down to San Clemente and break them in. And so we go in the water, we're bodyboarding for a good few hours, and we get out and decide to take a break and get some water and stuff. So we get out, drop our boards off and our fins off with the rest of our stuff and go to the snack shack. And on the way back, I realized that my board's now laying flat on the sand and my fins are gone. Someone stole them. I just got them the day before. And I was like, crap, I was pissed. And I asked everyone surrounding us if they've seen them and all replied no. I'm like, crap. So after a few minutes of searching, I just gave up the hunt, decided to go in the water and cool off. And while I get in there, me and my friend are joking around. We're like, of course it's my luck. Buy a new pair of fins. I love them in the water. And they're gone now. But we started thinking positive. I was like, well, whoever the jerk was who stole them, they're going to love them. They're awesome fins. Like, <laughs> it's cool. Hopefully he gets them stolen from him. And then those person enjoy them also. Maybe it'll be like a cycle. And... Uh, that brief moment of positive thinking when I'm super pissed off, I feel something brush up against my waist. And I'm like, it's, I'm in the water, I feel something hit me. Of course, I start freaking out, I start thrashing at it. And then I reach down and I pull this up. And I'm like, oh, it's a fin. I just lost some other fins, now I got a new one. And a sweet ocean karma, you know? And then, uh, because I'm not a fin stealing jerk, I ask all the people around if, us if they lost a fin. And they all replied no, so I was like, cool. I guess I'm gonna keep this one. So after that, we get out of the water, collect our stuff, walk back to my car. And uh, my buddy lives in Huntington Beach, so we get on the freeway, get off on PCH. And uh, after a few miles of driving on that, I pull up to a stoplight, and there's a, uh, I see a familiar shape resting against the curb across the street. I'm like, no way. And it's another fin, just sitting on a curb. And I'm like, Okay, and I'm like, dude, get out of the car and go get that. So he goes and gets it and brings it back in perfectly good shape. So uh, I guess the lesson that I'm sharing with you guys today is that I don't, you can get screwed with, uh, you could lose your stuff, but brief moments, if you can cool down, think lightly, maybe have some positive thinking, things start, I mean, things lead to a better outcome. You know? Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.